A blessed day learners. I'm teacher Lumaban. Let's take a review on physical science. Let review. Set 11a. Be ready and prepare yourself as we embark. Learn and enjoy this video. Be safe. And God bless you always. Commit your way to the Lord, trust also in Him, and He shall bring it to pass. Psalm 37 verse 5 Which of the following is a scalar quantity? Letter A weight Letter B velocity Letter C acceleration Letter D temperature Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter D temperature. The temperature is a scalar quantity. Which of the following describes a vector quantity? Letter A it specifies direction only. Letter B. It specifies magnitude only. Letter C. It specifies both magnitude and direction. Letter D. It can be a dimensionless a vector quantity. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 the correct answer is letter C. It specifies both magnitude and direction. Specifying both magnitude and direction describes a vector quantity. When a bullet is fired from a rifle, the force in the rifle is equal to the force on the bullet. Why is it that the energy of the bullet is greater than the energy of the recoiling rifle? Letter A. Because there is more impulse on the bullet. Letter B. Because the force on the bullet acts for a longer time. Letter C. Because the force on the bullet acts for the longer distance. Letter D. Because the bullet's momentum is greater than that of the rifle. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5. 4. 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter C. Because the force on the bullet acts for the longer distance. When a bullet is fired from a rifle, the force in the rifle is equal to the force on the bullet. The energy of the bullet is greater than the energy of the recoiling rifle, because the force on the bullet acts for the longer distance. In a coordinate system, a vector is oriented at angle with respect to the x-axis. The components of the vector equals the vector's magnitude multiplied by which trigonometric function? Letter A sin angle. Letter B cot angle. Letter C tan angle. Letter D cos angle. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5. 4. 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter A sin angle. In a coordinate system, a vector is oriented at angle with respect to the x-axis. The components of the vector equals the vector's magnitude multiplied by trigonometric function called sin angle. An ant on a picnic table travels 30 cm due east, then 25 cm northward and finally 15 cm due west. What is the magnitude of the ant's displacement relative to its point of origin? Letter A 29 cm. Letter B 58 cm. Letter C 70 cm. Letter D 99 cm. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 
The correct answer is letter A 29 centimeters. An ant on a picnic table travels 30 centimeters due east, then 25 centimeters northward and finally 15 centimeters due west. The magnitude of the ant's displacement relative to its point of origin is 29 centimeters. What will happen to a moving object in the sum of all the forces acting on it is zero. Letter A. It will slow down and stop. Letter B. It will accelerate uniformly. Letter C. It will change the direction of its motion. Letter D. It will continue moving with constant velocity. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 the correct answer is letter D. It will continue moving with constant velocity. The object will continue moving with constant velocity in the sum of all the forces acting on it is zero. Acceleration is always in the direction of the blank. Letter A net force. Letter B final velocity. Letter C Displacement Letter D Initial Velocity Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter A Net Force. Acceleration is always in the direction of the net force. A brick slides on the horizontal surface. Which of the following will increase the magnitude of the frictional force on it? Letter A putting a second brick on top. Letter B decreasing the mass of the brick. Letter C increasing the surface area of contact. Letter D decreasing the surface area of contact. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter A putting a second brick on top. A brick slides on the horizontal surface. Putting a second brick on top will increase the magnitude of the frictional force on it. The potential energy of a body at a certain height is 100 J. The kinetic energy possessed by it when it just touches the surface of the earth is blank. Letter A cannot be known. Letter B equal to the potential energy. Letter C less than the potential energy. Letter D greater than the potential energy. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 the correct answer is letter C less than the potential energy. The potential energy of a body at a certain height is 100 J. The kinetic energy possessed by it when it just touches the surface of the earth is less than the potential energy. What happens to the kinetic energy of an object if its speed is doubled? Letter A. It will be halved. Letter B. It will be tripled. Letter C. It will be doubled. Letter D. It will be quadrupled. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter D. It will be quadrupled. The kinetic energy of an object if its speed is doubled will be quadrupled. What is the type of energy possessed by a simple pendulum when it is at the mean position? Letter A. Sound energy. Letter B. Kinetic energy. Letter C. Potential energy. Letter D. Mechanical energy. 
Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 The correct answer is letter B kinetic energy. Kinetic energy is the type of energy possessed by a simple pendulum when it is at the mean position. A ball is thrown upward into the air at a speed that is greater than terminal speed. On the way up, it slows down and after its speed equals the terminal speed but before it gets to the trajectory blank. Letter A it speeds up. Letter B its speed is constant. Letter C its motion becomes jerky. Letter D it continues to slow down. Choose the suitable answer based on the given choices in 5 seconds. 5 4 3 2 1 the correct answer is letter D it continues to slow down. A ball is thrown upward into the air at a speed that is greater than terminal speed. On the way up, it slows down and after its speed equals the terminal speed but before it gets to the trajectory it continues to slow down. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Philippians 4.13 I hope you enjoyed, learned something new about our topic on physical science, lead reviewer. If you learned something in this video, please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to share this video with your friends. If you have comments, questions, and suggestions, you can leave a message in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching my videos. Hoping that we meet again in my next video, and God bless you always. It is Teacher Luma Ban YouTube channel.